Assalamu alaikum. Uh, this is Mr. Saim Shtaik. Okay, this is a very short video uh, regarding labels as requested by one of my students, Talha. Um, labels actually is a kind of a report in which data is uh, represented not in row wise, just like a normal report, but uh, in blocks or groups. So if, let's say I want to make labels of any particular uh, query. So, so simply I can just make a query. I'm just going to just make a very simple one like this one. Let me add some more data to it. Well, obviously I could have added a table as well, but here we go, I'll make a query. So um, let's say I have the following, okay, right? Uh, not, not a very relevant data, but fine. It doesn't make a difference. So let's say I just want to add or in English would be this, EA1, fine, I'll just save it. So obviously if we make a report of this directly, this is what a normal report is. And obviously, you know, in every uh, row you have, uh, what were the data? So every row uh, has the record, but no, it's not why I'm trying to explain. I can create a label. So I can click on label and I can choose from here is custom labels and we can select from over here is a, a way. So let's say if I want two column labels, I can use C2244, okay. If I want three, I can use this. If I want one, I can use this, so right, in metric. So you can come next, next, and I can probably uh, have a heading here. Um, I could, that's the down arrow key. I can write away as the uh, pupil number and transfer the pupil number field here. I can have is the four name and transfer the four name here. I can have is the surname and transfer the surname here. And just one last one. And I can have is let's say English here and I can transfer the English records here. Okay, uh, you can even write your names and you can number down here if required. So uh, let me just somehow put it in the middle and next, next uh, and finish. So you see, this is what I'm getting. This is uh, how labels can be made. Uh, you can even go at the back and you can adjust this. So let's say if you want a label that is supposed to be uh, <clears throat> nine, uh, eight point eight, uh, let's say, uh, se uh, se se centimeter and six point something centimeter. You can do the adjustments over here as well. And you can print preview it. Okay, you can make the adjustments here or there is an alternate way, which means is I can come into labels, I can go into customize, and you see it's 6.2 by 9.7. So edit, I can enter over here 6.2, the height, and 9.7. So uh, it's the width. So I can enter the height and the width here as well in metric. So I can make my own labels as well, right? So this is how we can actually make labels. I, I hope it's clear, right?